okay welcome back to my youtube channel today i will show you how to make this part 3.25 kite bracket on the nx simon cat software or unique graphics so if you are ready to open the nx simons you click new and here select the model click the model and then give the name of the part that you want to make it 3.25 kite bracket okay after that you must click ok and the file is already exist might be already done to make it before so i will select this and change the name again underscore e okay okay for this view i will select the view from from this i will make the circle first and then i will make the line like this going to the top okay easy click sketch click here sorry you must analyze the analyze the view first this is i hope front view and this is top view okay after i will try again select sketch front view click ok select the circle select this point and make the circle click cancel select line from here to here sorry i will select the profile to make a simple going to this 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 area and this point right click and then okay okay after that you must define your dimension select the rapid dimension the whole of this part is 25 click this circle and click 25 enter click close from this from this to this is 113 select this rapid dimension select this line to this line and define your dimension 113 sorry 113 and then enter right click and then close i will move this first i will move this first like this like this okay something like this and you must give this dimension 35 and 16 select this like this and 35 enter close i will make right this first select this going to the top like this and then select this select this line and this point give 16 and then okay enter right click and then oh, close okay after that i will give this angle 30 select this rapid dimension and then select angular dimension select this line and this line and give 30 and then enter okay something like this and then close after that i will give the height of this part the height is 60 click this and rapid dimension select this line to this line and 60 enter close and then i will give distance from here to here is 38 okay click here select this point to this point 
give 38 close and then the next you must give the angular also and at this 45 select this and angular dimension select this line to this line and give 45 enter close and then you must uh, give the direction or give the dimension from here to here center is 33.5 select this select rapid dimension select this point to this point 3 3.5 enter and then close sketch is fully constrained it's all ready to make the extrude click the finish sketch going to this isometric view and then select the extrude select this line and this circle I will make the I will make like this and give the thickness is 50 click 50 on here and enter and apply after that cancel okay after that I will make I will make this and this okay I will select sketch from here I click OK maybe I need to rotate not this okay something like that select the profile make like this one two three four and five right click and then okay also make it first make this select profile one two three four and five right click and then okay okay right click okay select this line to this point sorry to this point to this point cannot make the uh, strike so I will select this project off select this and then apply select this and then apply cancel and then select this line and this line make make what I tell you make this and this something like this and this to this something like that okay I will move with the manual and select this select the vertical okay uh, I select control Z on your keyboard select this and then select this okay after that I will define the dimension the dimension is 35 I will select first the dimension is 35 and 16 select this rapid dimension from here to here 16 enter and then here to here is 35 after that click OK and close okay after that I will select this 35 and 16 16 okay select rapid dimension select this line to this line click 16 on your keyboard and enter select this line to this point give the 16 enter and then this is 35 enter after that you can see and then close the sketch is fully constrained it's meaning that the project or the part will be or can extrude or subtract select finish sketch going to this and make the isometric view and then select this extrude select this curve select this select single curve 
select one two three and waiting for the three point this 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 line and this line waiting for three point okay select this and going back to the bottom select the subtract okay apply and then something like this okay i will hide this sketch click this sketch right click and then hide also for this right click and then hide okay after that i will make this okay i will select sketch select on here and okay after that i will select this rectangle from this point to this point right click and then okay give the dimension 16 select this and select this line and click 16 enter after that click cancel okay i will uh, subtract from this to this select the finish sketch select the extrude and select this sorry finish sketch finish i will try again select extrude and then select connected curve select this and reverse the direction the subtract turn choose or select the value but select the uh, until selected i will select this okay cannot be done so i will until extend select this okay something like this is done and you can click apply and click cancel okay your model is already make it so i will hide this right click and then hide you can change the view from here something like this wireframe wireframe with head edge studio like this and also team with frames okay something like this shade it okay okay after that i will change this part with another color i will go into the view and then select the render click through shading after that click the global materials and then click this something like that and okay okay i will select this first select with edge select this through shading okay thank you for watching my video don't forget to subscribe give the comment and give the suggestion for another model that you want or the another tutorial that you want thank you see you on the next video